I'm not ready for this, so don't come out here. Please don't. Stay away from me. I've had bad experiences in the past with co-hosts, and I've become a really dangerous person when I'm near people. Oh, oh okay, no biggie. It, it should only be for a little while anyway. Okay, glad you understand. Hey, partner! <gasps> Who are you swinging oh, shut around up like and that? Didn't you hear me get beat up out there? It would have been nice had I had some backup. Uh, what? Are you alright? I'm just well. Thanks for asking. I did hear some screaming with a, a chainsaw, but I wasn't sure what- Well, that's what I was investigating until Bigfoot ambushed me. Bigfoot? I thought you didn't believe in that. Oh, don't mock me. It's a man in a suit, I know that. Why didn't you come out to help me if you heard all the noises? Uh, uh, um... Oh, I see. You seem to have lost an eye on that brat we're supposed to protect. I don't understand. Are you good for anything at all? It looks like I have to do your job too! Luke! Why does she have to whisper everything? Claudia! 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 Um, who is that? We still don't know what she's being protected from. And why here of all places? That's what I don't get about you stupid visitors. Well, we're here because... I know. To find your furry friend. And this schoolgirl is out here to somehow defeat Evil Kelly for the stupid sake of getting out of a dressing room? You think she'd just walk out of the building? I mean... We have tons of exits. somewhere yeah isn't it crazy one time Jesse used one of those because she wanted to know if she and our father would be more than father and daughter well isn't that already true I mean she is his father well, yeah but I I told her she has to use a magic eight ball for questions like that can't even stand in a ring she was better off in that room than anywhere else. What was she thinking to sign something like that? <sighs> this is too funny. Well, here we go. 
I'll give her 30 seconds. Or am I being too generous? I can. You don't ever go out to help them? Nope, just sit and watch. Why don't you help those poor defenseless people your father drags off the road? Th those aren't people! They're mermaids! Fish! No! Leave me alone! Go away! Go back to hell or something! No! Uh, it's ridiculous! No! Stay in the room! She's stupid. <laughs> I don't think she thought this through. No kidding, Autumn. Here. Ow. Sit back, eat some popcorn, and stop questioning stuff. Oh! So good! Do you have any rabies salt? No! 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 Why would you want to fight me? I didn't think you'd actually do it! What's the point of coming trapped anyway? There's no escape, Clydia. The chairs! Oh, she's coming! It's not a good idea to back up in that corner. Never mind. So boring when she keeps running. How about that? What are these fools thinking for cheering her on? What's wrong with them? Thank you, Claudia. Thank you. Don't you want to see her win? No. Where are you going? No. You know what, Kelly? I really didn't want to have to do this. I did not want to have to go through this match. I didn't want to sign the contract. You didn't want to push me into it. And you know what? All I wanted was to be out of the room! Out of the room! Out of the room! Out of the room! This was really dramatic. <laughs> of course it's dramatic. When you have a burning passion for something, like getting out of that room, it will be dramatic. She's already out of the room. Why didn't she just run out of the building? This is not a normal schoolgirl. Autumn, that was stupid. No, it's not. This is all in the name of getting out of that room. And can't you see and even hear the frustration and the seriousness in the efforts of Claudia? Mickey, haven't you ever been frustrated? Well, yeah. Oh, hold on. No, you, you, you were saying. You wouldn't understand. I wouldn't understand. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I've been dealing with for the past two years? Claudia is nothing, and Evil Kelly is certainly not on the level of what I had to deal with. You don't think I understand? You don't know what it's like to deal with growing up on a You don't know what it's like to be a hardcore woman, born and raised on a motorcycle bike, surrounded by rebels. We had to steal and commit crimes just to make ends meet. Why do you think I always look so hardcore, with tattoos, and ready to kill somebody? Can't even fight. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Get up! Come on, Kelly! I'm tired of this, Kelly! It's hard when people fight back, isn't it, Kelly? Autumn, 
We are awfully quiet. We seem to have lost touch of the match. Trust is hard to come by, you know, Otto. Uh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Takes a Kladea magic. Yeah! You didn't think I could actually fight, did you kill it? Yeah! Lots of people have sat in the seat next to me, and all of them ended up betraying me. I can't even speak her name, but she put me in the hospital. I can't forget that. Uh, how terrible! So when I saw you skipping down that ramp, I had rage boiling inside me. Autumn, I was scared. Oh! I had no idea! You didn't trust me! <gasps> what happened? She fainted over a chair. The very weapon she wanted to use from the start. Worst time to be fainting. She's done for! Sorry, Autumn. It's okay. We all knew a demon would win against a brat. It's common sense. You know, you're you're actually an okay person. I, I don't get to say that a lot, and you're weird. But yeah, you're okay. She wasn't done. Claudia! Claudia! No! What would Luke think of me? Please tell me you're alright! <laughs> oh, she's still whispering. They are always too late. They're too late! These bodyguards! They're a joke! What academy did these idiots come from? <laughs> Oh, I am sorry, folks. This I cannot take any of this seriously. <laughs> Nikki, this is really bad. <laughs> Do you know why this happened, Autumn? Why? A bad friendship. Kelly was betrayed, and she snapped. Hey, if you're truly Biggie's best friend, don't ever turn your back on him. People can be crazy, and Kelly has never been the same. <laughs>